Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Void Train. If things look, look a little different, that's because they probably do. Uh, it came to my uh, attention that the screen brightness was adjusted to 37 in the uh, settings. So I've got it about 60 right now. It seems to be better. It's definitely a little hazier in here, but I was always having trouble with uh, doing screenshots. I couldn't really, you know, I was having trouble um, sort of whitening up the images because it was so dark in here. Uh, I'm hoping it's not going to be too bright when we go out, to, go out into the void. Uh, I have done a little bit since the last episode. I uh, added a few more chests here. These are actually going to be for assembled, assembled guns. Uh, that's just for keeping store, space over here for modules. Uh, as you notice by my inventory, I have a whole bunch of ammo, ammunition made up. i got a bunch of plates and I have 10 bandages. I'd have more, but mud of leather. Uh, today, I want to go and hunt down the arenas. And I think uh, after I do an arena, I can re-trigger it by going back into another one of the... We'll call them pigeons. But uh, other than that, uh, that's all I really want to do. And the reason why I want to do that is because in order to start upgrading into the boiler upgrade and the traction to get towards the steam engine, we actually need rubber for both of them. And the rubber itself... I need four pieces of rubber. And the rubber is actually made in the lab too here. And the rubber consists of... Oh, that's, that's not the lab, that's, work, that's the workbench. There's the lab. And rubber is one acid, one resin. Now, it says void, but I have a feeling, from what I've read, you can only get it from the arena. So, we'll see about that. Uh, before I go, uh, I have been trying to keep my f hunger up for well, the, the second health bar there, but it's kind of hard because I have to make sure I have food for these guys, which reminds me... I want to make sure they have food, okay, and take the other bandage too. Uh, what I do want to do is, uh, I forgot I had a gun here. I, was, I think I was checking out a different magazine on it. Oh yeah, I want to take this, try to take this magazine off and see if, put it on here and get a few more rounds. Actually, let's try that right now. I do have to, do have to repair mine. Okay, we'll take that off. Oh, uh, I gotta put another... A magazine on there, but I think I think I have a spare one around here. Got that one. I should try that one. Uh, ah, that's the one I was looking for. And yeah, we'll go back here. We'll throw uh, this one on here. Oh, and that's just so I can take the gun off the table. And then, uh, oh, that's not the one I want. Aha, fast flapper. There we go. I do have to repair it. I gotta get some iron, uh, iron scrap for it. Uh, I want to see if see, this increases the overall. It's actually better. Quicker reload speed and three more in the magazine. All right, I'll do that. All right, now uh, do I have any iron scrap? I do. That's all I had left. I went through. Oh, I got a stack there. I went through everything making these ammo, this uh, ammunition. Oh. Wish you could interact with the table while the gun was still there. Alright, yeah, fast. Oh. Why did the damage go down on this? Did that really make a difference? Am I missing something here? This is a faster reload speed, but it does less damage per second. Sure, we'll go with it. And I have to repair it again, I don't know why. Alright, anyway, uh, let's go into the void. Uh, oh yeah, let's put some stuff away first. That's why I did that. And then I have lots of room for all my, my things. And off we go. Uh, I'm, what I'm going to do is we're going to put gun away. I'm uh, going to head off to the void, uh, see if there's any storyline that sort of triggers. If not, and then I will meet you at the arena. And also any uh, witch puzzles I come across. Alright, what do we have this time? Ooh, interesting. New path number 11. Got any story with this one? 
I don't think so. Anyway, I shall meet you in a bit. I'm gonna go gather up some, probably pick up some scrap and a few other things along the way, and uh, I'll meet you later. Okay, so I've been going along here for about 10 minutes now. I kind of lied about not picking up any <laughs> any supplies just because, well, theoretically I do actually need stuff, so I'm going to try to pick up whatever I can little by little. Uh, it took me a minute to actually notice this, but uh, I'll show you in just a second here. And we have more trucks. Now, I haven't triggered any, no event's been triggered yet. I have absolutely no idea what I'm supposed to do. When we start coming across these guys, these guys, I know I gotta get their attention. I'm hoping the the steam, the whistle on the train is loud enough. If not, I might have to, you know, use my gun. I do want to try to pick up some scrap, but I have no idea what's gonna happen. Should be seeing it many times now, I think. Don't really wanna. Cut the recording just in case something happens. It's weird, I could have sworn when we picked up that, that last uh, Reflimo there comment. I could have sworn he was more of a white color, but now he's like a blue. Are we actually going to switch onto the track? I'm not paying attention here. Uh, you know what, let's stop for a sec. I do want to get this. As if we're going to be upgrading the train, we're going to be needing a lot of iron. Definitely. No idea what's going on here. Oh, grab that one. And then what? We'll, then we'll go. Okay, let's go. No. Oh. I honestly have, a, have no idea what happens when you uh, run into the the others. Oh wow, last scrap here. Oh, gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give I didn't need the zinc, but I grabbed it anyways. Oh wow, we're gonna be getting like right close to them. Interesting. Is this gonna be like a full on battle or something? Are we going to get hijacked? This is weird. I'm wondering if there's ever a chance we get to choose a, a direction for a new path. Like, look at that. There's stuff over there. I have no idea what this is about. I'm going to pause and I'll bring you right back. Shall we give them Roflimo back? Which one? <laughs> uh, okay, so... Uh, oh, God. This will be interesting. Uh, do we fight, run, or fight? Oh, got ammunition. Let's do this. Get the high ground here. Yeah. And so, where are these guys? Are they behind me or something? They destroy their engine, well. Got the ammo, let's do it. Come on. And I'm dead. Oh wow, I didn't realize I was 
I was dying, huh? And I'm dead again. <sighs> I had no idea this was a thing. And I did it again. Thank God for infinite lives. Is that it? Let's stop here. Come on. Well, that didn't go as, well, as planned. Okay, so where is all my stuff? Oh, we learned something new today. Oh. Goodies. So, my body's back here somewhere. Uh, we're gonna have to go over here. I wonder what kind of goods they got we can snag. Uh, what am I missing? Did I lose all my stuff or what? I have no idea. Uh, let me look around and I'll bring it back when I've recuperated my losses. Okay, well, I've been able to find my stuff. So I tried to do a save and reload, and that just took off on its own. I could have destroyed it. I could have sworn I destroyed the engine. Uh, no, I haven't found anything. I actually grabbed some throwing rings, and I w worked my way back a little ways, and I haven't found much. I did find a couple of mag clips, or a couple of modules, and that's about it. I haven't found my gun, I haven't found my suit. And, uh, from what I've seen, apparently every time you die, you lose, you have a, I think you have a chance, or you do lose something. So, I lost my grappling hook, I lost my gun, I lost my suit. So I gotta make everything again. Fortunately, I do have guns. I actually do have guns. Uh, I don't know if anything compares to what I had. Uh, that was the one I was working on before. I could probably modify that. Uh... Anyway, I got some stuff to recraft. Uh, let me do that, and I'll bring you back when I'm done. Okay, I'm back, and as you can tell, we are rhyming through an outpost. Uh, they just... Uh, the track just veered off of uh, guys that were trying to overtake me. And we come across an outpost. Uh, as far as recuperating... Uh, oh, jeez. Oh... I have no idea which ones these are. I know there's two different types of mines. There's uh, the impact mines, and then there's uh, uh, mines that home in on you. And I don't know which ones these are. Kind of why I don't like hitting the afterburner going through. Uh, but I was thinking we probably could have outrun the other train there, because the track did veer off. It's just a matter of getting past. But. We would have blown through the outpost, which I had to fix a ram for, and then we would have ran right into a minefield. I have not actually hit one of these things yet, so I have no idea what they're going to do. Uh, as far as my situation, uh, I can't actually make a new suit because I need leather. 
I do have a, I do hear a leech nearby, so I can probably get some light from that, but other than that, uh, I'm kind of on my backup suit here, which doesn't have the extra inventory slots and only has one armor plating. Uh, I haven't really done much with the guns. I do have these, but they're not the automatic. They're uh, sort of like one-shot deals. Oh, hang on, got to reload. Okay, this one's actually doing auto, but that, I don't think that actually has good damage rate. This one, it's more like a sniper. It's not bad. It's got a high damage, but, you know, the fire rate's not the best. So I might have to try to work on this one a little bit. But uh, this kind of kind of derailed my mood for this game right now. I might uh, sit on this for the night, and then I'll continue the episode tomorrow. So that's why the video is going to be a day late. So I shall return. Okay, it, I am back. It is also one day later, and uh, I also have a brand new suit. Uh, I was able to actually get some leather from uh, these little guys flying around. Uh, I also realized too that uh, that the extra three slots wasn't actually the suit; it was the backpack that gave it to me. I completely oversaw that one, uh, but unfortunately, I haven't come across an arena. Like I haven't. This is more or less like a couple of minutes after I ended up ended the the last clip and we're already at the void gate so i'm thinking uh we might not be seeing the arena until then the next path the next void so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna gather up a few resources and then uh when i'm done i'll bring you back we'll head inside and then we'll do what we gotta do in there and we'll call this an episode it'll be a little shorter one this time but uh we'll see you inside we have arrived at our destination. Didn't really find too much. Found some scraps, some wood, some uh, uh, chemicals. And that was about it. Uh, I'm hoping that maybe we can start finding this acid in like the vending machine or uh, some other places. Oh, the slot machine too. Oh yeah, yeah. the vending machines. They have the exchange machines there, and uh, the slot machine. I do have two tokens from my little derailment there earlier. And I might get a few more here. Um, I'm actually going to go deal with these guys. Uh, check out the new guns. See how they hold up. And see how they do. Because uh, next episode we're going to go hit up that arena. And we're going to hit it up hard. And we're going to get as much ass as we can. Because I want to do this once. So I don't have to do it again. And we do have a new Reflimo. And uh, over the usual suspects. Because everything looks the same here. So let me go deal with them. And I'll be right back. Okay. I'm back. There was, uh, I think there was a few more of them here than there normally was. Uh, this one is actually really good. I was doing almost 200 with a headshot, where uh, this one here wasn't doing as good because uh, this isn't isn't automatic, right? It was doing about half. This is actually a pretty good gun, so I might actually work on this one here. Um, let's see what we have for modules here. I uh, probably won't pick anything up except for anything that's not green. I will take the tokens, of course. Uh, this guy up here dropped something good. I want to see what it was. Uh, what did I pick up? No, rifle ammo. And a token. More ammo. That's what I wanted. Ooh. This actually might be good. Uh, other than that, I don't really see anything that's of interest there. Uh, come and get the supplies later. Pick up any ammo. That uh, is going to be a common grip, so I'm not too worried about that. Let's see what we have down here. Another gun, what, are, what is that? In blindness. Sure. We'll take it, see what we got. This guy here, this is actually the, the shotgun guy. I took him down pretty quick. Uh, I, of course, I. <laughs> it was right in front of my face. What is that? That is a shotgun barrel, possibly? I have no idea. Uh, other than that, oh, there's another one up here. Still not going to replace the purple one I lost, so it's a grip. I actually have one of those. Well, I don't see too much else, so I'm going to do a little bit of loot, and I'll bring you back when I'm all done. Okay, I'm back, and I uh, couldn't really find too much. I might actually find some leather, which I found some surprising. Uh, so what we're going to do is, first we're going to go in here and see what we have. I actually have eight tokens on me. I found six here, and there was two, at the, two from earlier. I'll grab that. I'll grab that, of course. And let's see what we're in not stand there for when the bomb comes out. Chemicals. 
Leather. Oh, three leather, actually. Ammo, which I'm all filled up on, so next. And crap. Oh, what do we get? What's that? Oh, it's a clip. Cool. Look like I added 17 rounds, and there's nothing there I can use. I wonder what happens if you get Reflimo. Maybe probably get a mushroom. More chemicals. Let me see. Oh, apparently I think you get an artifact. I think that's what it's supposed to be. Three chickens get a seed. Three candy gets a token. Interesting. Never actually looked at this before. All right, so obviously the purple is going to be the highest tier. Okay, cool. Let's see what we can get here. Anything that can actually we can buy a bearing? Cool. Pipe. Eh. Nothing really interests me. I don't think there's much else we can actually do here. I don't think we can upgrade the train at all. I don't think we can build any modules. Uh, I was actually about to go out that back door. Uh, what we can do, let's have a look. I don't think there's actually anything I can do to this thing. Uh, not really. I can't can't upgrade the platform. I can't build any modules or anything like that. So uh, this can be good with that. Uh, one thing we can do before we go, or before I end the episode, we can see what come, what this guy has to offer. Oh yeah, I forgot I had the I forgot I had the coal on me. Ha ha ha. Uh, come on, X, where are you? Uh, oh, there we go, ha. Ah. Okay, I'm gonna pick up my coal, I want that. I forgot I put that in the crusher, and I end up on my backpack. So sometimes it goes in the backpack, sometimes it goes in my hand, I don't know why. Oh. You're interesting. Extractor gives a chance to create a bonus item while crafting up to work events. Reduces production time at the gathering station by 15%. Hmm. Do we take them on board? Like, I don't think I can actually place it, put them down. Like, uh, the only place I could place a bed is in here. And it doesn't let me place it in here for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know if it's the walls or if it's the locomotive or what, but we could not place a flame bed here for some reason. Hmm. And this this is all taken up. I got four in here. And there's absolutely no way to get one in here. Let me think about this. Well, I hate to say this, but we're going to need a new comment. So... We gotta find comment and get rid of him. Unfortunately. So all he's really doing is a steam engine fuel and I don't really use it unless I really need to. Uh, they're talking. Well, I'm sorry, uh, you are a comment, right? Yes. Alright. Where'd you go? Alright. Kick you out. Goodbye. Now, we have a new comment. And if you'd like to leave a comment, please do so in the, down in the comments below. Defender. Invite you. Okay, let's... Of course, I'm going to pick you up and you take off. Oh, look at that. He's sitting on a dolly. Isn't that something? I was going to say the weirdest one yet, but no. Uh, share is... Alright, there we go. So now you're going to be the gatherer. Let's get you all set up here. Uh, run back here, run back here. Doo -doo -doo. I almost feel like I should be able to run faster. All right, worker info. Okay, I'm gonna take a like out and we're gonna put share, uh, put comment here. All right, so you should actually be getting me more resources, which I actually forgot to check. 
Yeah, I got a few things. Hopefully you do a little bit better. But anyways, I think we're going to call this one here. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I know it wasn't the, the greatest episode. We did get derailed and almost blew the engine to kingdom come by running into a minefield. But we won't let that happen again. But anyways, I thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.